Hey guys, so I am moving my new room. <laughs> I didn't take on a before picture, but I have before pictures, I guess, so it's okay, but if you all of my gel polishes and nail polishes are on this wall and stuff, I started everything yesterday. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna give you a little um, a reason I'm moving is um I wanna start taking hand models not clients just i need like three hand models that i can do nails on and i can showcase on my youtube channel hey guys welcome back to another video and as you can see i am getting ready to pack up my old nail room to do my new nail room so in my house um we have an office which is by the front door and i decided that hey i'm gonna move my nail room down there from upstairs and move the office up here because as you know myself and my husband we work from home and man this was a task let me tell you i took so many nappers in but i'm gonna let you guys watch me go through everything packing up um it was a journey it was a lot like there was times where i was like no maybe i should stay up here even when i like took everything off the wall <laughs> i was like man i think i really need to stay up here so yeah, um, go ahead. Problems disappear. She could tell you the things you want to hear. She could read your mind and that you could believe of a little lie to tell yourself a time. Never get it wrong, it's always right. I don't even know if you guys saw me celebrating, but um, now I'm just taking down the shelves. And once I take the shelves down, I will fill the holes in. I did do this um, different times of the day because I did need to take some breaks, which I did take. All I'm doing here is removing the little things that goes into the holes when you're screwing things in. So I just removing them from the wall. Now we do the other wall. <laughs> There's so many walls. 
Like I literally was like crying inside and out like what am I thinking? Because all I could think about is I gotta put all this back up on another wall. Like is this really what I want to do? Like literally I was questioning my choices and thinking that it would be easier if I just put my gel polish shelves back up and put my gel polishes and polishes back up and just be done instead of going through all this. It was a lot. It was a lot, guys. A lot. But it's done and I'm happy. Hmm. I am moving my nail room. <laughs> I didn't take on a before picture. But I had before pictures, I guess. So it's okay, but if you remember my cover acrylics were up here and um all my gel polishes and nail polishes were on this wall and stuff i started everything yesterday um i'm gonna give you a little sample video because i'm recording everything and yeah that's where i'm at so i mean i have all my videos and everything up for all the way through till the end of the month so I'm good, I don't have to record anything right now, so I'm not worried. And the room that I'm moving into, I have to paint, and I'll record that too for you guys to see. And yeah, um, a reason I'm moving is um, I wanna start taking hand models, not clients. Just, I need like three hand models that I can do nails on and I can showcase on my YouTube channel. Because if you guys don't know, I'm really trying to focus on my YouTube channel and stuff. So yeah, like we did fill the holes. There's so many holes and stuff. Um, so we did that. I'm gonna leave this here because I'm gonna turn this into my office. If you guys know, I have a day job. If you don't know, I have a day job. 9 to 5, I work remotely. Um, so, yeah, you know, so much stuff to move. And, yeah, so I can't wait to show you guys the video of the whole process. I've been calm, cool, collected, but you're pushing on my nerves. And knowing your attention, I'm under pressure. Okay, I'm admitting that a couple things I said got acidic in the town and the presence of so I bought these glitter off of Amazon and I'm gonna mix them in with my paint. I um, went to San Francisco recently with a friend and in the room that we stayed, the wall um, had like a really nice ombre brown color and it also had glitter in it and I was like, I really like this. I think I'm gonna do this in my nail room. And um, yeah, here I am doing it in my nail room. So I picked up five glitters from Amazon. I can't remember the specific names, but everything I've used will be listed in the description box for you guys to go and see and figure out where to get them from. But I thought I didn't need all five and I ended up needing all five bottles of glitter but it was perfect it was just a perfect amount of glitter because i didn't want it to be overwhelming on the walls i didn't want you to just see glitter and then paint i wanted you to see paint and glitter and i think this mix so i did use two gallons of paint but i think in the end i think i only use a gallon and a half of paint so i put both paint into the bucket and then you know did my thing and this is the room right now it's a blue color it's like a dark blue color of course this was my old office with my husband that we shared and i'm turning it into my nail room and this is me painting so guys i did not get all the painting i started having issues with memory and for some reason, me putting up the shelves did not record. Well, me and my husband putting up the shelves did not record. I do not know what happened. That whole footage was missing. I was livid. I was livid, livid. Because I know I recorded because my husband came in to talk to me. And I was like, babe, I'm recording. 
so I know the cameras on mini cameras on everything is just I I don't know <laughs> I don't know what happened so I just I'm like I, I didn't get to film film the um the painting because I started having issues with memory and I did not I don't know I know I recorded it but it did not record of me putting the shelves up and stuff so yeah that happened and I just I'm just like forgive me guys and forgive whatever is going on but I'm all sorted out with my memory and everything now and my camera is working perfectly fine I got a new one and sheesh but here I am putting up the gel polishes and stuff and what I decided to do was take all my young nail polishes and put them on the top shell because I'm when am I ever really gonna be using regular polish so I did that I know in previously I said I was gonna get rid of them but I decided to keep them and I'm just color coordinating that's how I like to do things I think it's very pretty and I'm just sorting through to make more room right here but I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys watch as I do this So as you can see, I'm putting up my Valentino gel polish, well, V Beauty Pure gel polishes. I'm still trying to get used to the new name. Um, there's over 238 of them, I believe, and I'm putting them up by number and not by color. And now I'm putting out my Vendini gel polishes that I got from AliExpress. I absolutely love these colors. If you're looking for really good glitter, different glitter effect, Vendini is the way to go on AliExpress. And now I'm putting up my cover collects and I chose this side of the wall because it would be easy for me to get them.
I am placing them alphabetically and by number, numerically as well. So that's why you see me trying to sort things below. It's just because I'm sorting them numerically and alphabetically before putting them on the wall. And right here is where my middle child decided to do a cameo for no reason. <laughs> So I decided to finish everything else off camera and just focus on getting everything done and then I will sh go ahead and show you guys the final look of everything, how everything turned out and show you the wall to see the glitter and everything like that. So we're going to roll right into that. Hey guys. So we're gonna do the tour of my nail room. So that's what it looks like entering the nail room. And this is what you see when you come in. My new nail space. I am absolutely obsessed and I absolutely love the paint. You can't really see the shimmer because if you remember I put some glitter and stuff in there but we're gonna start a tour and I'm gonna show you guys the wall and the shimmer as well so over here I did put my transfer foils and stuff and my nail stickers and that's what it looks like and then I have my giveaway drawer right here if you guys remember me showing you guys this recently and then I have my press-on stuff and then some other knickknacks that I do use from time to time. And then going around the room, this is my table, my desk, and yeah, my humidifier. No, not humidifier, here, purifier. And my lights and my setup, as you can see, and stuff. My and I was doing this nail design and I stopped in the middle of it because I was having camera issues if you guys remember me stating that I was having some camera issues so up here my polish my polishes on my wall some of them and then I have my cover acrylics right here all of them and then I have my swatch sticks right underneath. And then right here, I have my massive gel polish and polish wall, which I am absolutely in love with. And right here in this opening, if you remember my old nail room, I have this lady on the wall, this decal. So I reordered it, I got it from AliExpress. I reordered it so I can put it here because we decided not to take it off the wall from the other room. But look at my wall. Oh my god. This was painstaking. I took a lot of IB not ibuprofen, but nappers in and stuff for my back. I do have back issues. And um yeah, um, you know, I took a couple days of rest and um back. And then this is my other wall and I just have like my Samuel Land model ones um 
really cute and my McCarts on this wall and then my cuts um, those are stamping polishes and stuff then I have my camera say hi camera and yeah you know have my little swatch stands from a Vendini I am absolutely in love with Vendini guys I'm obsessed with them they make this these gel polishes that is to die for check them out on aliexpress amazing polishes like look at that look at that you can't you can't beat and look at this one. you can't beat them you really can't like i love my valentino but when it comes to like different glitter effects and stuff Vendini is a place to go and it is absolutely affordable even um this one which is the diamond dust and if you know Kara Sky has them Vendini has it too and it's half the price <laughs> half the price and it's good quality I have no issues with them like look at that look at that oh my lord <laughs> like every time I open um a pack that I a collection I get from them I'm just like yeah and then over here you know I have my monomer and my cover stuff and then I have my press on and my acrylic powders right here along with my picture box that I used to take pictures with and then the swatches of my polishes are right here you can see outside in my house yes nobody lives in front of me in front of me is all woods and no houses will be built there and then I have a little TV I didn't take bring down my big TV if you remember I have a really big TV I think it's 50 inch so I decided to keep it up there and just have this one because I feel like having a big TV down here would be way too overwhelming so we decided to keep this small one in here because this room used to be our office space where we worked, me and my husband. So now our office space is upstairs um, and stuff. And then I have my pedicure chair. So I used to do pedicures when I decided to take clients. And um, I got this off of Ali, if not Ali, I got it off of Amazon. And it's actually in my Amazon storefront in the pedicure folder. And it's very affordable and it's a massage chair as well. And I also have the pedicure basin that I use and everything all in my Amazon storefront. And yeah, so let's do a 360 if I can. And then I'll show you guys the wall to see the glitter if you haven't really seen it fully as yet. <laughs> and yeah, that's that's what everything looks like. You guys know what's already in um, these drawers. I have my top coat, my gloves, and then some miscellaneous stuff. These are all my poly gels that I have. And then my acrylic powders as they're listed by name right here and then I have some more my loose glitter and then all my glam and glitz are down here and then over here I just have like some more acrylic powders and stuff as you can see nail supply glamour glitter planet and then some extra stuff and whatnot and then in my desk my desk I have you know my Hard gels, my tips, all my tips are over here. Then I have um, some miscellaneous stuff like my cover, my um, clear, my clear acrylics and stuff are in here. And then I have like my hard gels and poly gels and stuff over here. And on the other side, I have some more miscellaneous stuff and some croissants and my towel. And as you can see, my, I think it's Starlight Light that I bought on Amazon. It is in my Amazon storefront. My Archon, 
actually this is not an archon this is something else that I got from Amazon and then I attached my archon to it to extend because I was trying to extend just my archon but it was too flimsy it wasn't strong enough to hold my phone when I did the extension so I got this instead which is more sturdy and then I did a little thingy thingy and attached some pieces of my archons to it and it worked out pretty good and then I bought this leather pleather desk mat for my desk and stuff which I like and it's pretty affordable and let me find a spot so over here let's see if we can see the shimmer can I see the shimmer so that's what my wall walls look like with the shimmer as you can see I'm hoping you guys can see it I can see it but get closer that's what it looks like so I'm happy with my nail room I'm happy with how the walls came out and everything some spots have the shimmer more than other spots but it's very um spread out and nice and i love it i love it like you can literally see it more when um when you're in it in person like you know like me standing here i can see the shimmer and everything I'm trying to show you guys um over here there we go some more shimmer so yeah i am happy with how everything turned out um i have some stuff to do oh these are um designs that i did that are about to be um shown on youtube i already upload them and scheduled them for showing um but i'm just showing you guys you know my my space again you guys know what's in here if you've watched my previous videos to know what's in these so i'm not gonna like go full on um with what's in everything because you guys already know if you've watched my previous video of my nail room tour and if not go watch it so you can you know know what's in my nail room and all the stuff i mean i've gotten a lot more stuff over the couple months and stuff but um pretty much everything is almost the same especially when it comes to you know where i put everything can you guys see the shimmer i think you can see the shimmer so i'm happy i'm happy with everything so yeah yeah guys yeah. thank you for watching thank you guys for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe i appreciate you guys being here i hope you love the turnout of my new nail room and i can't wait to showcase it more with you guys